The Five Stages of Change. Recovery does not happen without change. Stage one, pre-contemplation. No change is being considered. There may be denial of any problem or reason for change. The person does not see themselves as having a problem. No consequences are being experienced or acknowledged. Stage two. Contemplation. There is now awareness that change may be necessary. The person begins to consider the pros and cons of change. The person is thinking about change. No action is taken toward change. There are often conflicted emotions. Uncertainty. Perhaps ambivalence toward change. This stage could be quick or it could take a long time. Some stay in contemplation for a lifetime. Stage three, preparation. This is the research stage of change. The person typically has made a commitment to change. They may start to gather information and take other small steps toward change. Often people will skip this stage, jumping from contemplation directly to action without considering or assessing the pitfalls and difficulty. This could interrupt or delay the change the person is seeking, causing a relapse or otherwise re-engagement. Taking time to prepare and make an action plan will help to achieve long-term change. Stage four, action. There is a clear plan for change. Direct actions are being taken toward change. Most people in this stage are open to receiving help. Most people in this stage are likely to seek support. There is overt effort toward change. Stage five, maintenance. The stage after new change is adopted The person is prepared for pitfalls. They have a support system. They have developed coping skills. Continuous conscious action is taken to avoid relapse. 
thank you for watching.